Right, so uh, we decided to try it on the bird first, right? We should uh, take uh, a wild one because uh, you do not want uh, to that it goes if it goes wrong, you know, it's just a wild animal. There are lots of them over here. Yes, yes, but we also don't have an infected wild one. What was that? I'm sorry. Which one is infected? Uh, this one right here. The one with the spots. Well, uh, maybe you should take some of his blood and uh, put it in one of the dodos there up, up, up over on the hill. I then you can also study, for example, uh, the time it takes for the infection to spread. Uh, would you do me a favor? Do, do we have enough time for this, or should we? Away. It's not. Or should we just deal necessary. with trying to deal with the man in the tent? Yeah, of course. Thank you. Um, well, uh, we could. Uh... Timers of the essence. Yes, I, I just, I'm not sure if it'll work. Well, uh, do you actually know what the... Uh, he is violent, uh, delirious, uh, and dangerous. Yes, but that's because of the reduced oxygen, oxygen in his brain, right? Perhaps, but uh, using him as a, a test subject, how smart is that? It's all we've got at the moment, and the longer we leave it, the lo Right. Yes. Right, let's do this. Let's... Okay. So, are we doing it or what? Yes, yes, let's do this. I, I'm... Well, Good. It's entirely your decision, I guess. That's just a bit worrisome, that's all. I will leave it to the doctor. All right, so just so we know the process, it's uh, knock the knock him out, bring him close to death, and then pump him full of stimulant. Yes. And I'll repeat, I'm not a doctor. I don't know if this will work. I just seen, I've, I've read a lot of um, Looks like there was a journals on the subject. On the map, which is very cool. I would. I I don't know. I would place it possibly. Before you, oh, you probably need to take his blood as well. One moment. Uh, you should uh, put. Uh, uh, you should uh, give him the blood uh, once he wakes up, because then his heart will beat at a normal rate. If you sleep, it lowers the heartbeat. We're hoping the stimulant will get his heart racing, even if he's sleeping. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, but that I could imagine. also like. Uh, if you do those two things simultaneously, he could result in a shock, and he will die of a shock eventually, or perhaps do you even wish to into try and coma. do this? Well, uh, I do not like to play with human lives, but... Uh... <laughs> well, this human life is nearly extinguished, so we're doing what we can. Yes, I know, but I'm uh, just sharing a little of my knowledge, you know.
Oh, she cold. Yeah, she's pretty cool. She's pretty cool, though. I like Queenie a lot. Great, great character. Great player. Great artist and writer as well. On the forums, she's all over. Sorry, I just needed some air. I should probably say I. I mean, I. I read books. I don't do this stuff. This isn't what I'm good at. I. I read journals. I find out what other people know, and I. I'm not There's a doctor. Still down here, doctor. We're uh, taking quite a lot of blood out of his body. We can't let him go dry. has to do bring him to near the yes but don't snuff the brain I'm worried that I might have given wrong information you know I just don't want the man to die because I read some books Think of this approach, Thomas. I don't know. Day one. I haven't seen day one. Like. It's quite risky. They do know so less. They do not know enough about this disease. So I'm not sure. If he comes back out of this, we might be able to ask him more questions and actually get some answers. You know. Yes. Yes. Just enough. Yeah? Why is Never that? been there. We're not planning on going. If it started there, it means it's still there. Yeah. Well, have you guys heard the voices just... over, over the radio? No. Uh, I don't keep a radio on me. Yes, there's a, uh, there was a girl, a girl's voice, mentioning something about still water, and infection, a lot of static, so it sounds like it's pretty ominous, sounds like it still could be there, maybe. I hope this will work, Amadeus. Alright, the transfusion is nearly done, how about the stimulant? So, for those of you who don't know what's happening, we are doing a blood transfusion to a dwarf, hoping that it'll eradicate his infection. Uh, until now, it's uh, go going steady, as far as I can see. What's happened? It looked like he fainted. 
Now I see the man. Okay. Right. Um, may I get closer? Is he alive? Um, is he alive? Uh, check his pulse. Put his two fingers in his neck, and you should be able to count his heartbeat over a minute. We need, uh, Every time do you feel the metal. heartbeat, uh, you should uh, count it until. Trying to diagnose his uh, heartbeat per second. It should be higher. Normally, it's around 80 to 100 for a man. And uh, in another alien Irish, uh, especially after some stimulant, it should be around 120 to 140. So, if he has a healthy heart. Hmm. Okay, that's something, that's right? Awesome. Well, that's weird, right? Because uh, his uh, pulse should be going like crazy right now. No, he should be dead. I'm glad there's a pulse at all. Yeah, but I mean, like, you forced him to feed Simul and. What? He's Is he talking? He's he's awake. I just don't, don't want him to be startled. Hello. Yes. Could you put the light away for a moment? Thank you. Baron. Baron, are you all right? <clears throat> Shit. The fuck? I'm not sure. Did he run out? Oh, why is he going? Who opened the door? I did. Oh shit. Whoops. Is not fast. Not fast at all. Damn. Oh, a bit tired. Did we get a. Oh. Uh, I'm sorry. Oh, well, it didn't work. I'm sorry I opened the door. I just I figured it would work. It was a silly thing to do. He didn't say anything though this time, so it does seem a bit hard for him to just run. He didn't show uh, any maybe he's in a state of shock. Maybe. Maybe he's in a state of shock, so. Should we bring him back to the island? I don't find it. To keep a man in a cage. Well, you're not entirely sure yet if it didn't work because yeah. uh, 
I'm just... He could be in a state of shock, you know? Yes, that's also, right. He did just wake up. I'm just worried. He woke up with a bunch of people staring at him. Yes, he could be, he could be a bit shocked. Uh, well, let's just... Uh, leave him alone for uh, well when he wakes up. No? People as it is. Uh, on, only one person in the tent, I guess. Uh, someone who was a dear friend of him, who was able to communicate. That kind of stuff. Uh, I'm sorry, what was that? And that uh, perhaps only one person should be in the tent at the moment, and someone who is a dear friend of him who can ask him some questions, like his name, his age, to determine uh, if he's uh, still gone mad. Could you do it, Tegan? I need to make a sign. Let's see what. Uh, mm. Well, uh, uh, someone you just met is not someone to be trusted. But someone will. Sir Walton. Yes. Uh, how long uh, do you know this guy in the cage? <laughs> That's a good point. I've known him for about a week now. Nobody else met him before, right? Uh, just Sir Walton, then I guess. Danger. Right. Uh, well, uh, Sir Walton, since you uh, have known him the longest, uh, yes, you should probably go in and uh, try to determine if he's still sane, but uh, wait, 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 do not go in yet. You, you should try, uh, you should try uh, looking at uh, certain symptoms, uh, see if his hands are, stopped, if he's maybe a little bit shaky, just try to pay attention to that kind of stuff, the small things. Alright. Uh, that way you will be, try, uh, that way you will be able to determine his sanity. Uh, it looks like the skin splotches are still there. Oh, his eyes are still red, it looks like. No. Uh, his hands don't seem to be shaking as they were. Try uh, asking him some simple questions, see if you can get a response out of him. You should um. close the door. Do not open the cage. Something feels off. I uh, do not trust the entire situation. Baron? Uh, in the 
happened to bring any food with you? Did you do so? Do you know what? Do you bring any food with you? Yeah, I got some wet here. Um, yeah, I forgot to pack. Baron, do you recognize those words? Is he awake? He's awake. Uh, yeah, uh, Sir Walton is uh, talking to him right now because uh, he knows him the best apparently. Only for a week though, mm. but uh, it's our best chance to determine his sanity for now. As long as he doesn't get hurt. Well, I, to I told him to keep uh, the cage. Just in case, you know. Yes, well, we told him that in, uh, in the past, but he still opened it, didn't he? Baron, uh, old man. Well, uh, Baron then I'm already my rifle already. You're, uh, <laughs> next few yes. for as long as you need, my friend. Well, uh, what's happening? Doesn't seem responsive. He just stares at me. I showed him his old notes, but he just held them, and then he uh. looked away, so let me try something else. Right. It's brain death that I uh, warned uh. you about. I told you it causes brain damage. Well, Baron. he could also still be in a state of shock, so... Baron. Is that Amadeus? Is that a bottle of rum? You're a fine pirate. Tell me one more about your brother. Tell me about Dane, Baron. Sorry to have mentioned it. Like I said, we're here to help you. This cage is your home until we find a way to bring you back. Trust me. Nothing can harm you while you're here. You may think you are, but you're not alone. You may think that you and your brother are the last, but they are you. You are not. You are the first. You're the first of a new era. An era of kings and legends, and you will be part of it. You will be a survivor of this disease or infection, whatever it may be, and you will rise among the rest and people will cheer your name from all the rooftops. You will not be snuffed out like a candle in a weak breeze. Enjoy your stay here. 
I hope it's warm enough for you. Undead zombie baron. Yep. So far. I don't know this music is that real. Right. So unresponsive. So I think it's better just leave him in the cage until until this pa this is passed, or until we find a cure. But until then, I think I need to rest. My mind is plagued with thoughts and hate and frustration. Thank you, Pterodon, for taking the tub. Shit. Why so? You tried your best. But you should indeed take your time. Yes, it's just I'm just rather frustrated and tired. It's been a long couple of days. I've seen death far too much in the past week. I've seen mortality more times I could imagine, but I've never seen it plagued a one fortnight of my time as much as this, this week has, so I'll be I'll be in my quarters. Good night. Should you all. need to get away? If you should ever need to get away, you can always come to the the farm. It's safe there and quiet. Right. I'm gonna head there now. Alright, be safe. Be very careful. Try not to leave the walls unless... Unless you know it's yeah. safe. Yeah, yeah. Probably best, well, if you uh, were to come here, best travel over the water. Okay, will do. Alright. Keep safe, everyone. You too, Queenie. Safe to, same to you. Queenie. Yes? Be careful for me, will you? I'd, like, I'd hate to Same goes for you. you. Don't do anything stupid, okay? I won't. Make sure you come and see me when you wake up. I will. Right. Good night. Um, Daryls, it was uh, wonderful good seeing night. you. Thomas, it was nice meeting you. I'm sorry I must make my way to bed, but uh, I just, I'm sorry that we were a little less hospitable than you probably imagined. But when the castle is ready, we'll have a feast for everyone to come by. And yeah, well. And that's quite all right. You seem to be in a lot of trouble right now. Good night all. A good night. <laughs> well, how is it with this uh, contagious person? Could I perhaps take a look at him? Alright guys, thank you so much for hanging out today. Sorry about that. Amadeus, yes, Amadeus is in our tribe. Uh, he is our medicine man. I, uh, he, he's our, like our doctor. So, yeah, he's like our maester, our doctor, our medicine man. So he's he's going to be the, the, the clergy or whatever it is. But um, I have to head out, guys. Thank you so much. Uh, I've got a, I've got a thing I gotta do with a buddy of mine to create Warlock, the trading card game. So, um, I'll see you guys later. Uh, thank you so much. I should be on tomorrow night, hanging out with, uh, Encounter Roleplay, and then after that I will be doing a stream. So I'll, uh, I'll see you guys later. And, uh, yes I did, I invited him in. I invited him in. For little frick. But yeah man, uh, I'll see you guys later. Thank you so much today. I'll get this up on YouTube as soon as I can. I'll see you guys. Bye-bye. Mm,